Hello and welcome back to Teofila Vasileva channel where we bring you the best of art and culture. Today, we're going to talk about one of the greatest opera composers of all time, Giuseppe Verdi. Verdi is known for his works such as La Traviata, Rigoletto, and Aida, among others. But there are many lesser known facts about his life and work that we're going to reveal today. So, without further ado, let's jump right in. Fact 1, Verdi was a champion of Italian nationalism. Verdi was not just a composer, but also a patriot. He was deeply involved in the Italian unification movement and saw his music as a means of promoting Italian nationalism. In fact, Verdi's name became a rallying cry for Italian nationalists during the Risorgimento, or the period of Italian unification. Fact 2, Verdi was a farmer. Despite his fame and fortune as a composer, Verdi remained connected to his roots as a farmer. He owned a large estate in Santagata, where he lived with his second wife, Giuseppina Streponi, and where he cultivated his own vineyards and olive groves. Fact 3. Verdi was a humanitarian. Verdi was known for his generosity and compassion towards others. He was involved in charitable work and donated large sums of money to help people in need. He also provided financial assistance to young musicians who showed promise, even if they could not afford to pay for their education. Fact 4. Verdi had a long and fruitful collaboration with librettist Arrigo Boita. Verdi's collaboration with librettist Arrigo Boita began in the 1880s and continued until Verdi's death in 1901. Their partnership resulted in two of Verdi's greatest operas, Otello and Falstaff, which are considered to be among the most masterful examples of the genre. Fact 5. Verdi was a widower twice over. Verdi was married twice, first to Margarita Baretzi, who died young, and then to Giuseppina Streponi, who was his longtime companion and mother of his two children. Streponi herself was a noted opera singer, and the two had a close and loving relationship that lasted until Verdi's death. Fact 6. Verdi had a close relationship with the French composer Hector Berlioz. Verdi was a great admirer of Hector Berlioz and the two had a close and respectful relationship, despite their stylistic differences. Verdi once said of Berlioz, I cannot help admiring his talent, even though I do not always understand his music. Fact 7, Verdi was a composer of sacred music as well as opera. Although Verdi is primarily known for his operas, he also composed a significant amount of sacred music, including a requiem mass that is still widely performed today. His religious works are notable for their emotional power and dramatic intensity, which is characteristic of Verdi's style. Fact 8, Verdi's last opera, Falstaff, was a tremendous success. Verdi's last opera, Falstaff, premiered in 1893 and was an instant success. The opera is a comic masterpiece that showcases Verdi's skill as a composer of both music and text. It is still widely performed today and is considered to be one of the greatest operas of all time. Fact 9, Verdi was a modest man. Despite his fame and success, Verdi was a humble and modest man who shunned the trappings of celebrity. He preferred to live a simple life, surrounded by his family and close friends, and was always focused on. Fact 10, Verdi's legacy as a composer lives on to this day. Verdi's music continues to be performed and enjoyed by audiences around the world. His operas are regularly staged in opera houses and theaters, and his compositions remain an inspiration to musicians and composers. Verdi's legacy as a champion of Italian nationalism, his collaborations with librettist Arrigo Boita, and his impact on the world of opera make him one of the greatest composers of all time. And that's it for today's video. We hope you enjoyed learning these lesser known facts about Giuseppe Verdi. If you have any other interesting facts about Verdi or any other great composer, let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.